String Calculator Kata Exercise 7. Delimiters can be of any length and not just a single character. There's a special format for that. The seventh requirement is to enable a custom delimiter string in addition to a custom delimiter char. So I add a new test case called Add line with custom delimiter string returns correct result. It requires an instance of the SUT as well as a delimiter string, a count of integers to create, and a generator of ints, which will create those integers by taking count elements. The numbers input string is produced by adding the custom delimiter declaration to the delimited string of integers using the custom delimiter. The actual value is the result of invoking add on the SUT. The expected value is the sum of the integers. Finally, the test verifies that the expected and actual values are equal to each other. Currently, the test throws an exception before the assertion, so according to the red-green refactor process, I must first put the SUT in a state where I see the test fail as expected. I do that by returning minus 1 if the input string contains two forward slashes, followed by a square bracket. The test now fails as expected, which prompts me to remove the condition I just added and instead change the implementation. If the numbers input string starts with two forward slashes followed by a square bracket, the delimiter is found by getting the substring until the index of a closing square bracket. All tests now pass.